All right, so you're probably wondering, you see a bag of wood, you see a gym bag, you see a backpack, and you see a sandbag. Okay, it's actually a sandbag workout. But in reality, not a lot of us have a sandbag at home, but you all have something, uh, you know, one of these, maybe not the bag of wood, unless of course you're at the cottage like I am this weekend. That can be used also for the workout that I'm doing now. Another good thing is if you have a big bag of rice or if you have waters a bottle, uh, bottles of water, anything that you can basically hold with you and you know, it's not gonna be too crazy because we're not throwing stuff around but it's a great, great tool. This is the actual sandbag that it's meant to be. It has handles and stuff like that, and it's a great tool. And I actually have rice inside it, but you can put sand in it. I find sometimes if it does break, you get sand all over the place. Um, so it's not the best, but I mean, it's filled with rice right now. So anyways, guys, we're gonna grab a sandbag and I'm gonna show you the, front, the first exercise. It's a front squat. So what we're gonna do is place the sandbag, whatever you got, and we're gonna keep that in our hands. You're gonna front squat down. So you're gonna go as low as you can go. The good thing about using duffel bags is you can fill it as much as you want. So depending on your fitness level uh, and depending on how much time you have and how much energy you wanna put into the workout, you can fill it to as much as you want. All right, so that's our first one. That's a front squat. Our next one, we're gonna be jumping a little bit. You're gonna put the piece, uh, you know, the, the bag down, the sandbag down. We're gonna do a burpee. So watch, watch me. The truck. We're gonna go down, up, hop over, and down, up, hop over. Hey guys, give it a try. There you go, Jax. You can do it in here. So again, you can do this as a team. You can take your team sports out and do this. You can set yourself a timer or you can set yourself, give me 10 burpees and do it three times. So there's a little different ways that you can do the workout and I'll explain that too uh, in the word part, in the word section of the workout. All right guys, tired? Next exercise? I'm just getting them, I'm getting them all exhausted. All right, we have a plank with a drag under. All right, so we're gonna do here. You can either go in a full plank and you're just gonna pull under using the opposite arm and, and pulling it under, or you can add a push-up. So you're gonna push up. As you come up, you're gonna drag it from underneath, down, up, and drag, okay? Give it a try. For the little guys, you might just have them move it over if they're not too coordinated to do something like that. Here, buddy, use this one. Okay, so push up and drag from underneath. There you go, he's doing it awesome. Good work. Keep your butt down. Amazing, all right. So as we're doing that one, I'll explain the next exercise. You guys tired, you need a break? All right, next exercise is a lunge with a bicep curl. So we're gonna take our sandbag. Really great functional movements too that you are teaching the kids. These guys can do this stuff around the house. All right, we're gonna lunge, come up, and bicep curl, you okay? Lunge, up, bicep curl. Okay, who wants this one? Here you go, Noah. All right, lunge, there you go. Here, you can use the backpack. Okay, so you're just kind of using anything you have available at home. This works your glutes, your lower half, your legs, your quads, your hamstrings, and of course the biceps, the guns. Bring the guns out for summer, right? Awesome, all right, our, our next one we have is our last one, basically like a shoulder toss. So I want you to kind of start down on the ground, Oh, thank you. Okay, and we're just gonna huh, toss it up. Get back down, huh, toss it up. All right, big sack of potatoes, just like that. All right, or picking up one of your brothers and uh, hoofing them right over your shoulder. All right, one shoulder, oops, be careful. Just, just lightly, honey, just like this. Oh. Oh. Okay, just a little bit. Anyways, these guys are working out. I think they're gonna be so hungry. Make sure you stay hydrated. Check on the kids often. You don't want them to get hurt. Have a great summer. Thanks for hanging out with me. Fitness at summer camp.